What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Gaming Channel. I am CJ Gills. How y'all doing? We are back here with State of Decay 2. Let's see here. First things first, let's grab a little bit more ammunition. That's, uh, let's see. Oh, wait. No, I did not want a full 30. Well. You know what? I'm going at I'm going after some plague hearts. Screw it. Let's let's take let's take as much ammo as we can as we can bring. Um Time for us to talk about more than just survival. We're gonna rebuild this world. Thermite grenades. I don't need flashbangs, I'll bring a soda can bomb, bring those Molotov uh, stack of Molotovs. Um bring a pipe bomb. And Two grenades. Wait, did I bring two grenades? No, I brought one. Why did I only bring one? I got two grenades. Alright. Oh, I should probably also bring some medicine. The base is nice, but it's the people that really make this place. I have to get more of those. Use that bandage just to heal myself up a little bit. All right, now I need another. I need a. I need a companion. Why would I want to argue against Andy's plan? Why can't I remember the controls for this game? This is what happens when I play. I was playing the other State of Decay earlier this morning. Yeah, in just uh, just about three minutes, we'll have this uh, we'll have his armory done. Sorry, I was getting text messages. Awesome. Damn it. Okay, so we can't bring Andy. I want to bring Andy because he's our. Without enough storage, we lost some resources. Great, we lost more materials. Well, we got plenty of materials, I guess. Let's upgrade our watchtower now that I think about it. Help uh, fight against our uh, fight uh, siege risk. Come on, I need a, I need a buddy. Hey, amigo. Hey, I need to borrow you for a little bit. You're the boss. See if I, did I leave anything in this. Nope. Okay, thought I might have left something in there. Don't know why. I should probably gas up before we go, but. Is there an inf oh my god, there's an infestation right on the other side of the plague art. Oh, that's gonna be a gigantic pain in the ass. Wait a minute. If I remember correctly, there should be a shit. These guys are coming at us. There should be a gas station that I haven't looted. I keep my to-do list pretty short. Stay alive. Everything else is great. Classic. If I can remember what the hell it is. We're probably gonna miss that. Damn it! Speed the fuck up, dude! Blew off my door. God, can we just... Can I... Hold still for like two seconds just so I can check my freaking map. Because we're gonna need... We're gonna need gas now that I... Now that I look at it. Project is done, folks. Uh -huh. 
I'm, I'm actually not entirely sure what the armory does. Ah, there we go. Gave us an achievement. Jeez, it's just people to run over right now. I also I really wish the the plow at the front of this at the front of this uh, truck wasn't like just cosmetic. It actually protected us a little bit. Now there's a gas station around here that I haven't. That's a military checkpoint. Damn it. Popping up out of freaking nowhere. I can't, uh. Just trying to find that just a quick second to hunt for something on my on the map. I know there's a. Got a freak in my sights here. I know, I'm trying to kill it. Got a oh. Passenger. Oh, crap, crap, crap. Dead, coming in hot. Damn it. Gotta retreat back to base. I'm not going I'm not going out a uh, at a plague heart with somebody who's Fatigued and injured. It's a, it's a dumb decision. Trust me, it's a guy who makes a lot of those. I gotta find a new utility truck. The hell am I driving? You know, I, I really like to like playing this game because it gives me a chance to sit here and talk with you guys. But kind of like when I was playing playing the uh, the original State of Decay earlier today, I just I really just don't have much to say. I mean, like it's there's not uh, not a whole lot going on with me. Um, Up all that. I'm gonna find Andy. Might as well take our probably one of our strongest characters out. How are you? I think you'd better handle things for a bit. Yeah, we got we gotta we gotta swap characters. I know it'll. I can't see. Ah, ah, I'm stuck. Like I said, I know it'll it'll. Drop Gene's uh, Gene's mission, but kind of have to. Uh, let's see here. He uses seven six twos, aren't they? Do I even have any of those? Could have sworn I had some seven six twos. A couple AR fifteens. We may want to thin out the infestations around here before things get worse. Um. Sixteen thirty. Yeah. Sixty jeez. I gotta be careful with with my seven six twos and not overuse my soda can bomb. One of those. Oh, I don't wanna use one of my toolkits, but I kinda have to. Need a gas can, pipe bomb, take a stack of Molotovs, thermite.
There we go. Load up. Yeah, I'll take a new. I know this is this is absolutely. You feel like being neighborly. I know this is absolutely fascinating content. Watching me micromanage inventory. <laughs> But nah, this is uh, this is all important crap. I got to but I I'll take a couple high explosives. All right. All right. Oh, of course it didn't fix the f Oh, okay. Talking to me? I'm like, I, we didn't fix the door. What was the point of using that util that repair kit? There we go. All right, that's fixed. Fine tuning, improved gun accuracy for one out. Oh, jeez. And oh, cool. Okay, so we can craft ammo, craft muzzle attachments. Military explosives. Okay, this is a neat piece of equipment. Yeah, none of these, none of these upgrades really... Yeah, but we can't salvage weapons here, so there's really no point to it. Yeah, actually, I, I like this. Okay, craft ammo. How do we craft ammo? Okay, so it, it costs... Really? It costs a bullet resource? That's weird. Holy hell. Four, we can get 45 7.62s? Yeah, okay. That's that's worth... Uh, that's worth worth a little bit of a, a little bit of our ammo resource. Holy shit. You know, I'm, I'm bringing Dominic with me, and that might not be the smartest option, seeing that his, uh... God, what's his gun? I think he's got a... God, I forget what he's carrying. He's carrying a 22, I think. Oh, come on! What? I... You got C's up the ass, man. Didn't necessarily want to have to shoot the bloater, but... Oh, come on! <sighs> okay. Well, that's the last of them. Screw it, let's do this. We have a small zombie problem. Got time to help? Alright, it's an infestation. You got a shit pile of Zeds over there. I did well. Last video I was clearing out infestations left and right, and now they're just all back. Yes, I understand that a lot of that's probably it's probably because of all the plague hearts that are around here. Just drove right off that cliff.
Hey, look, it's our exploded truck that we ended <laughs> up having to leave there. Still really proud about that. All right. Got something to boost my endurance in a pinch. Oh, and I, I actually got three painkillers. Oh, well, I guess with, you know, with already dealing with an injury, I guess it's... I guess having the painkillers isn't a bad plan. Yeah, for once, uh, once food isn't my big problem, now my big problem is making sure I have enough ammunition and, uh, and medicine. Because I think my, I think my medicine's running low, now that I think about it. Hitting people, with, hitting people with open doors. Something satisfying about it. Zombies in all directions. Better be careful. Get off me. I just filled this damn thing up and I'm already low on I'm running low on gas again. I know I'm at the fucking plague heart. Right, pop this brain off. Port coming in, make him count! Go over the wall. Okay, time for a close encounter. Fire in the hole! Now that works great. I love watching Andy work now that he's a, uh, with the high level and sword play that I have. Dude just shreds through these guys. Damn it! Just gotta keep at it! Uh, 
no. That's one play card that won't give us any more trouble. Greg, got a little over one magazine left. Might as well do a search of the house. Wait, that was that that's a totally useless item. at the slaughter. Right. Oh, sweet. There are, there are multiple fuel locations. Okay, so there's a big yellow tank over there. Let's go check that place out first. Leave that to Dominic. Actually, I want to go. I want to go scope. I'm gonna go uh, scope the place out using my uh, using this billboard. Damn, that's one ugly bloater. Or come and get come on come on don't stand in front of don't stand in front of the you won't freak out um yeah fanning i'm i'm not gonna lie i'm a little po'd let's get to the truck there's a horde coming and i'd rather not be here when it gets here come on dominic Specializing in bladed weaponry. Awesome decision. Be careful, there's a fucking plague zombie out there. Yeah, well, they're all dead now. Should I put this? Yes. Chemicals, not something I need. I gotta make sure it's dead. Where should I put this? Alright, time to fiddle with the inventory just a tad. So I can pick things up. Okay, so chemicals. Those. Where should I put parts? This? Well, I can those parts. That's not a hard decision. All right, throw this gat. Uh -huh. Don't fall apart yet. There we go. That's fine if this. Hatch it falls apart. I got about I have another blade. All right, that's fixed up. Technically, we don't need another Molotov at the moment. Keep both of those. Keep all that stuff in our inventory. Nowhere for that to oh, go. Sweet, another gas can. 
Again, this is just gonna take a little bit of. Looks like there's a horde sampling in. Not a problem. Little bit of inventory management. There we go. Dump that. Pop in the ammo. Alright, exactly what we were lo why we came here. Problem solved. This looks like a waste of time. Hey, come on. Optimistic. Thank you for saying that twice for some reason. Yeah, that's a screamer, all right. Love that! I love that you, when you sprint at them, they'll uh, alone here. just pop their knees out from under them. It's awesome. Sounds like, sounds like there's. <laughs> there you go. One problem solved. Problem solved. Holy shit. Maybe I better see a doctor. You can't keep this up. Virgil fire. It's damaged. Just gotta keep at it. Play calm down. Yeah, I know I, I kinda went ham a little ham there at the end, but a shambling corpse to be seen. I was seeing I was seeing all the all the plague zombies start popping in around us going, okay, I gotta get us the hell out of here. Okay, there's a... Uh, all right, all right. We need we need to get we need to get him home because we need to get him patched up. Oh, jeez. There's a couple places I do want to come back out and search, but I'll do it with a different character because Andy also needs to 
head back to the uh, head back home because I want to come back out here, search this gun store. There's also a military um, medical camp a little further south. We'll go check those out before we uh, before we close out here. I, you know what? I've been going back and forth with this game over the Plague Hearts, and I, I gotta say, I actually, I, I rather like them. You know, I, I've been kind of thinking, eh, you know, like, on one hand, they're annoying. This isn't marked on my map. Oh, sweet. That's another military area, because that's great, because it's not only, um, not only the possibility that we're gonna find why can't I think here? Not only the possibility that we're going to find um, medicine, but also the, the possibility that we'll find ammunition. And even maybe some cool guns. But yeah, I mean, when, I, when I first was dealing with the Plague Hearts and I was seeing them pop up and, you know, kind of was dealing with them going, jeez, these are going to be really tough. But really, if you save your, like, throwable weapons, like your... Um, why can't I think what... You know, like your Molotovs, your grenades, your... Etc, etc... They're really not that hard to deal with. And uh, they provide some really exciting gameplay opportunities. Now, like, with that right there, why I just decided to just pull out the AK and just go pop, 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 right on the Plague Heart rather than fighting my way through all those dudes. Yeah, I, I, think, that, I think that is something that this game did a lot, a lot better than the first game with it was is kind of creating like a sense of urgency a lot of times creating kind of this uh, sense of intensity there's always something happening there's always something uh always something going on always something that you have to be either trying to find and collect or uh watch out for something like that uh, the first game i mean there were moments in the first game that were like that especially the very end of the game if you haven't seen it it, it trust me it's kind of nutty but that's the it's kind of the cool part about this game Yet, I will also say, this game has a lot less story than the first one did, and that's... Oh, God damn it! I will get out! Oh, I'm making some progress. This is like an 86 point turn. It's like parallel parking. But for idiots. <laughs> I stand by. I stand by this. This is one of the greatest things my dad, ever, my dad ever taught me, is that you don't ever have to parallel park if you don't want to. You just have to be willing to walk. <laughs> oh, God, when I when I had to when I when I had to you know practice for drive my driving test and all that you know like I like I had trouble p with parallel parking. You know my dad just basically told me he's like you know you never really have to parallel parallel park. I'm like, well, what do you mean? He's just like, well, if I mean, if you <laughs> just always, uh, if uh, you just never, if you just never parallel park and always find a spot where you don't have to. Oh, of course, there's there's zombies coming at us. down. We're gonna get mobbed by Z's. Find me a sick bed. Oh, 
Hey, buddy. No where I Just hang in there. I'll get you through this. Why not? I'm fucked anyway. Should be lying down, not standing up. Back on my feet and ready to kick ass. All right. Oh, awesome. Where, where's the zombie siege that was apparently coming at us? There we go. Hey guys, I'm back. Hey there. Later. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave nice him. Work, people. Mind taking over? Honestly, I'm kind of amazed by how much we've already accomplished. All right, so I got him with a gun. Not sure what, what's it, what's it take? P, uh, P07. Okay, it's nine millimeter. And his wrench. All right, let's go. Jeez, oh, we're low on medical supplies. I do not like that. All right, first things first, we're gonna hit up that gun shop. This is something satisfying about smacking these things with, car with the smacking the zombies with car doors. Oh, I missed that one. Oh, oh! Every time I almost run off that cliff. All right, this drops us off near the. Um, Why well, can't I think what to call it? Zombies is exciting, but it's not action movie exciting. I have an idea to fix that. back down this road. God, I keep trying to press a button and expecting nitrous. Stop loading every 10 seconds. Hey there. <laughs> We've got an offer for you, if you'd like to hear it. Eh, maybe some other time. Right now I'm doing stuff. remember about that gas station over here just in case we need it actually there's also that auto supply place that we should also keep an eye out for because there is a uh, good place to find I can't think what to call them auto repair kits there we go Three containers in here. Let's find them. We've lost touch with the soldiers carrying out Operation Drawbridge. I'm desperately hoping that someone out there can provide information on my missing troops. I'm your Huckleberry. Who is this? My name is Kelly Eldridge III, a 
but you can call me Sasquatch. I don't know that call sign. Are you with Red Talon? Ma'am, I'm with America and Freedom. But if you need someone to go into the shit and find your man, then yeah, I'm with Red Talon. You know, I, that is one of my biggest pet peeves with this game, is what the hell is up with this whole Red Talon thing? Like, it's like some radio drama. Oh, I broke open. I didn't take the rucksack. Son of a... Oh, well, it's at least 7.62s. Mediocre suppressor, man. Saw quite a weapon as well. Excessive speeding up, wearing through the gun itself. Okay, so yeah, I've, I've heard about this. So, the suppressors are no longer, like, shot by shot. It just drops the durability of the weapon. So, I'm just I'm gonna take it for now, because I'm not... That was a mistake. In all honesty, I never really come to a, uh, to a place where I need suppressors. God. Not a lot of... Not a lot of great stuff here. Wasn't that that gun the gun shop was a bit of a letdown. Granted, I dropped about like the one thing that I said I wanted to get out of there, but that was ammo uh, ammo crates. But there really wasn't even any there weren't even any guns. Well, that was pointless. Parts. Looks like this place is Zed free now. I think we've scavenged everything this F and all. All right. Well, we're zero for two. Now, frankly, we're low on gas. See, I'm still I'm still glad that gas stations make a lot more sense in this game than they did in the last one. Just because in the last one you, you're always finding food resources at, at gas stations, and it was weird. Like, ooh, you found you found all this this uh you found this 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 food resource. Okay, but you know it was a that's that's basically just all, all crap, right? It's all crap food. Probably not what we want to be eating in the apocalypse. What what the hell? Let's say a, I found a bag of snacks in a gas pump. Probably don't want to eat that. Just saying that. There's, there's no way that's sanitary. There's one more. that I will find. Love how they cannot climb ladders. Come on, there's gotta be one more container. There's one more container around here somewhere. Take one more. <laughs> okay, where is this last container that I'm not finding. <sighs> um, 
Yeah, I don't know. Search inside one more time before I just kind of give up. What the actual fuck? Alright, I have, I have no idea where the... Hell, any of that, where this last, uh... Last little resources. Stupid bastards. Horde cleared, but oh god, great, there's still some plague zombies sitting around. Jesus, go down! Already not a good sign. <laughs> okay, pain reliever, not not bad. Looking up. Some nine millimeter rounds, and holy shoot, look at that. Any more crap. That's a big gun. Ah, sweet, max level in cardio. That means we can. Specialize acrobatics or marathon. Yeah, sure. Let's do let's do acrobatics. Heavy damn. Take the scar. Take the scar and the uh, the frag grenades. Oh, medicine, awesome. Thermite grenades, kick ass. Mm, yeah, I got no room for that. Yeah, frankly, I really don't care about that. I'll, just, I'll leave the item. All right, we'll dump that. Um, and we'll also dump off the scar just for pure um, the weight. Pick up that gas can. Refill the truck. Just because we could use some more gas. Alright. One last thing I wanted to check before we... Alright. Allow... Jeez. Oh, thinking, do I have enough space to do that? You know what? There's a plague heart down there. We'll go take out that plague heart next time. And then I'll, ser I'll also search that um, little. Come on, I can only deal with so much. Uh, then we'll we'll take out that um, we'll take out the plague heart, and then we'll take on those um, that that medical camp. Uh, but guys, thanks so much for watching. I know this was one was kind of dry, but I hope you enjoyed the action and everything. 
Uh, please remember, as always, Facebook, Twitter, the website, Minds.com. Links to all that stuff is down in the description below. Please remember uh, to... Uh, I don't know what, what words I'm looking for here. Please remember to like, comment, and comment, and if you're not already, please subscribe to the channel. Why are words so difficult? Um, thank you for watching, and until next time, my name's AJ Gills. This is the Game Channel. I'm out.